Robbins. As worried as I am for Brink, I can't help feeling a little angry at him. He's wacko, nuts, out of his mind with greed. He's not himself. It's those damn crystals. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? I get the feeling the inventor didn't want us to do this. Of course we should. It's probably our only chance of getting home. We've got to try and turn on the inventor's machine. It's the only way to find out what it does. Well, we've got the part. After seeing what they've done to Brink, we'd better think long and hard before we start duplicating these back on Earth. Don't worry. We're probably never going back there. And even if we do, I doubt anyone will ever be able to figure out this alien science. Thanks. Brink. About the... I don't have time to waste on foolish discussion of nothing. When the eye is activated, it's a doorway into infinity. We can go in and come out anywhere. Home, Brink. That's what this is all about. To go home with everything we found. All we need is enough life crystals to get it running. I won't give you any life crystals. Do you think I'm a fool? Everything you say to me is a lie. You are both animals, victims of your base animal instincts. About the... I don't have time to waste on foolish discussion of nothing. What are you? I don't have time to waste on foolish discussion of nothing. Frank, there's a dead alien sealed inside a crystal tomb. In a culture that can raise the dead, they probably have a good reason when they choose to bury somebody instead of reviving him. Now leave me alone. There are side effects to the life crystals, Brink. They change your personality. They seem to be making you crazy. Yes, the poor, ignorant fools who slog through the mud of inferior mental functions. They look at brilliance and call it madness. Brink, I have to tell you, you're exhibiting signs of advanced dementia. You're paranoid, violent, and manic. I know you're saying these things to try to gain power over me. And if you don't shut your mouth, I'll shut it for you. We're on the verge of opening a gateway in the fabric of reality. If it works, we think it might lead us home. Yes, you and Maggie can go home. Do you think I don't know you secretly plan to leave me behind and take credit for everything yourselves? Thanks for helping me save Maggie. You've already rewarded me by being a pushover, Commander. Robbins. Poor Brank. Dying one miserable death wasn't good enough. Whatever died the second time, it wasn't Brank. It was the evil of the crystals manifested in Brink's body. I feel like I'm just what he called me. A traitor. A liar. You were dealing with a madman. You were trying to save him, too. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? It's probably our only chance of getting home. We've got to try and turn on the inventor's machine. It's the only way to find out what it does. Well, we've got the part. Thanks. <laughs>